Because dyslexia is unique to that person and it's a spectrum, no dyslexia is the same. When we read, there will be words dancing or there might be words like when you look at the sun and look away, you see the shadow of the sun, which is the halo effect. I might say a word, but I know it's a D, but I pronounce it as a B. And then the words might move, the words might change. I struggle with the memory thing. People ask you something and then as soon as they've asked you, you've forgotten it. I find directions hard. Turn left and I'm like, um, and I have to do the, this is the left, so this is an L, so I know that's the left. If somebody leaves a voicemail and leaves a telephone number, I'll have to play it maybe 20 times. I'll get the first number, then play it again, get the second. I can't do the sequence of numbers. My understanding of my dyslexia was I can know what I've written, I can even reread it five times with a gap thinking I'll spot the errors and still not spot the errors. But with someone else's text, because I haven't known what they've written and it's fresh to me, I, I will notice the details. You've really got to know yourself and learn some of your strengths and weaknesses as somebody with dyslexia. And I keep learning more about myself the more I challenge myself. To find out more about dyslexia, visit www.bdadyslexia.org.uk or www.dyslex.io.